future inventions that'll be available soon. Technology is a dynamic, ever-evolving field. In this video, we will see future inventions that will be available soon. But before moving further, hit the subscribe button to never miss any exciting video from this channel. The application of brain reading technology has significantly advanced in recent years and is no longer a sci-fi gimmick. Researchers from the Swiss Federated Institute of Technology tried one of the most intriguing and useful uses we've seen so far. These researchers have succeeded in developing a method for telepathic patients who are unable to move either their upper or lower body to communicate with the outside world. Their inventions include a robot arm, a brain-computer interface, and a machine learning algorithm. During tests, the robot arm would carry out easy tasks like navigating a barrier. Using a EEG cap, the program would then decipher brain signals and decide when the arm had performed a move that the brain had deemed improper, such as moving too close to the obstacle or moving too quickly. The algorithm can then be modified over time to take into account personal preferences and brain signals. Future developments could include brain-controlled wheelchairs or devices to help tetraplegia patients. According to the UN, there will be 2 billion extra people on the planet by 2050, increasing the demand for food by 70% by then. 80% of us would reside in metropolitan settings where imported food makes up the majority of our diet. Therefore, farms located close to towns on inland lakes or at the sea would undoubtedly cut down on food miles. A single 300 by 200 meter smart floating farm may generate 8.1 tons of veggies and 1.7 tons of fish annually. Since we'll need a lot of them, it's convenient that the units are made to bolt together. For instance, Dubai imports 11,000 tons of produce daily. With Google Glass, we've already seen a little portion of this, but it's only the beginning. Google Glass is a very new device despite receiving a lot of attention and stirring up debate. In actuality, every pair now is available is beta test unit. Google will release a lower cost consumer level version sometime in the upcoming couple of years. Alongside Google Glass, it's extremely likely that rival smart glasses will also be introduced. Some people might not like it at first, but the kinks will eventually be smoothed out and this is something that will happen. Despite the fact that more and more tasks are now automated, some still require physical labor, similar to adding someone to your email or phone contact list. Probably soon, things like this will come to an end as well. According to the video above, Relate IQ is already working to automate relationship management by creating a contact list for you based on information from your email inbox, current contact list, communications, etc. There will come a time when you will only need to ask for someone's name in order to instantly automatically construct a contact profile. We can already see this come to some extent with devices like the aforementioned Google Glass and smartwatches, but it's going to get much more bizarre than that. Smartwatches and eyewear are social tools that let you interact with the outside world. Other wearable devices that link your body are currently being developed. We're talking about fascinating products like temporary tattoos that use NFC technology to open doors and earbuds that can track your heart rate and blood sugar. You'll soon have alternatives for implants that will track your vitals in real time so that you can recognize a heart attack before your heart does. Once they figure this out for consumer use, it's likely to prevent deaths. Once more, this is something that is just about to become reality. We already have smart applications such as refrigerators that can alert you when you're running out of a certain food item in the oven that can operate using your smartphone. These gadgets will eventually combine into a single home device that you can operate with your smartphone, tablet, or computer. 
without getting up from your couch. You can adjust the heat, change the TV station, and receive reminders when your washing is finished. As you leave for work, you can preheat the oven for dinner so that you'll be ready to cook when you get home. Soon enough, you'll be able to communicate with your house as it talks to you. The technology is currently available. All that needs to be done is put it all together in a way that's reliable enough for customers. In actuality, some of these do already exist, to be honest. They've been used for years by quadriplegics to communicate via a computer. Though not quite as advanced as it could be, technology is making good progress. It follows that there might be a day in the future when a mouse or keyboard is no longer necessary. Things can be imagined and then shown on screen. This is excellent for gamers, those with disabilities, and others who want to be more productive. Robotics has advanced significantly over the past 10 years, and greater advancements are anticipated in the next 10. We're not yet talking about completely sentient robots, but we are talking about machines that are ready and dependable enough to begin operating. Most likely, it'll begin with settings like assembly lines and spread to other types of manual labor that people don't want to undertake. Even more seriously, we're talking about robots operating on patients under supervision of a surgeon and a technician. Demonstrations of robots that can pour coffee or discharge wads of paper into trash cans are available currently. Check that out. The final products can't be too far behind if those are the prototypes. The folks that are alive today are confident of one thing. We'll be the last living things in the world to have solely relied on fossil fuels for our energy needs. Significant advancements in solar and wind energy are predicted to occur during the next few decades. People are investigating other alternative fuel sources, including wheat and algae. Our reliance on oil and coal is still rather strong, but it's starting to wane. Expect a major push towards electric vehicles, the installation of solar panel on homes, and a lot of grumbling from oil companies and executives during the next 10 years. The first graphene sheet was created in 2004. Since then, researchers have been working to find a technique to make it in large quantities. Why? Because everything will improve as a result. We might get substantially faster internet as a result. Since it's 100 times stronger than steel, it will obviously be fantastic for building anything as well. It could be used to filter water and clean the oceans of harmful waste. It might be applied to cell phones to practically unbreakable them. Batteries will no longer be necessary since graphene's potential applications are almost endless. We won't even attempt to list them all here. We'll eventually figure out a great way to generate it in large quantities. Get ready for a second industrial revolution where graphene will be used in everything. Displays without screens are, in essence, what they sound like. Displays without a screen that show objects. It appears that this technology has advanced significantly during the past two years alone, and more advancements are anticipated in the years to come. Holograms that are similar technologies won't be science fiction anymore. Even contacts that project visuals directly into your eye are still conceivable. Won't that be a trip? This won't simply be a breakthrough for media or entertainment. Those with poor vision will finally be able to enjoy stuff without undergoing laser eye surgery. Comment your favorite technology in the comments section below. This was all for today. Hope you liked the video. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon to get even more updates and notifications. Stay safe, and we'll be back soon with another video.